Evaluation is the process of ascribing value to whatever element is being assessed. For example, it can relate to how successful a student was in achieving a learning objective, or can be the process of assigning a grade on a competency of practice. Feedback is an interactive process that aims to provide learners with insight into their performance. It is an informed, objective appraisal of performance intended to improve practice. The concept of value, or judgment, is not included. Feedback is typically less formal and the timing of feedback is best when it is immediate. So, in giving feedback, the preceptor is evaluating specific skills or behaviors, not the learner themselves, in a constructive process designed to improve performance. For example, telling Bridget that she is a good practitioner or that she did a good job. Example, Bridget, you're a terrific audiologist, is a vague judgment about the learner. Whereas telling Bridget, I was impressed when you stepped out of the interview format to comfort your distraught client, this showed sensitivity and compassion, is feedback about the learner's performance. Feedback can be given in a constructive or destructive way. Destructive feedback is often explosive or sarcastic, and usually comes from a place of anger or irritation rather than a desire to assist the learner. What the heck were you thinking when you used that assessment with Mr. Jones? Haven't you been watching me to learn the right way of doing it? Even positive feedback can come across in a destructive way. Nice job on that report, Jane. What are you trying to do? Show me up? Constructive feedback uses supportive language to affirm, reinforce, correct, modify, or improve performance. I was impressed with the way you helped Mrs. Smith to relax and feel at ease during the treatment session. Thanks for having the confidence in me to let me try that out on my own with the client. It felt great to have that independence. Your report writing skills are really coming along. Next time you write a note, try to be more concise and only include the points that are important for the rest of the team to know. I felt humiliated when you told me I did a bad job in front of the client. I really value your feedback and it would help me in my learning if you suggested another approach to use instead of focusing on what I did wrong. Sometimes a situation warrants immediate direct feedback, but it can still be conveyed without a personal attack that blames or humiliates the student. Wait, don't transfer that client without someone helping you.